All right, guys, I have my seed trays with my carrot sprouts that are in here. And so I have a nice cleared area here from where I picked carrots earlier. So I'm gonna go ahead and transplant these into that spot. All right, so these transplant pretty easily and this dirt is already all loosened up. So I'm just gonna place them right in there and they're still kind of little so still be really careful, but they're very forgiving. I thought I was gonna have some quiet for a few moments. My neighbor has a dirt bike track, and which is fine. We all ride it, you know, the kids and neighbors and friends all ride it. But, um, I thought they were taking a little break. So please forgive the background dirt bike noise. I'm just going to transplant them all down here with just a little bit of space in between them. Sometimes they get lost. Try to pull all the weeds that are in here. easy as pie and then the rest of this I usually just um will just dump in here like that all right and then I'm gonna go ahead and get the rest of them planted over here and then I'll just water them in but they're pretty watered in already because I have the the drip irrigation going all right once again I'm really sorry about the background noise but I really wanted to record um, this broccoli this is my first broccoli that sprouted and as you can see it's starting to flower so I'm gonna go ahead and just cut it right here. And we'll eat this part. And then what we can do is they'll start to grow new little shoots. You can even see one starting right here. Um, they'll sh sprout out more little shoots, offshoots of broccoli. And of course we can eat the leaves that the rabbit doesn't eat. But um, I wanted to show you guys that real quick. All right, guys, I could not film pulling these up, but because um, it was getting quite loud in my backyard, which is perfectly fine. It's a Saturday afternoon. I'm glad they're here having fun. Um, but uh, these are my two turnips that I pulled from my bin, and I have these radishes. Now, all of these came in the same packet. You would think that these would be exactly the same, but these are definitely different types of radishes. I'm not quite sure what happened. They came from the same seed packet. And I mean, look at these greens. They're just so beautiful. And here's my first broccoli. It's little, but you know what? It's Florida and it's been so hot. I'm surprised it's done much of anything at all anyways. And we've been eating the leaves along with um, Peter Rabbit. So I'm going to um, chop off these ends, these root vegetables, and the broccoli and the potatoes. And I'm going to roast them all in the oven. And then what I'll do is just saute these greens um, with some bacon grease and garlic and salt. And that would be delicious. And they'll cook down to like be nothing just like spinach does. So it looks like it's a lot, but it will cook down and we'll eat this all tonight probably. So my husband's going to cook some hamburgers on the grill to go with this lovely garden harvest. All right, guys. So this is all the greens that I ended up with once I destemmed it. And here are the radish and turnips cut up and the broccoli. All right. So all I have left to do is cut up the potatoes and get those to go. And these are part of the stems. I took the big ones out to the pigs already and these will go out to them now. All right, so I got all those potatoes chopped up nice and small right here. And there's the turnips, radishes, and the broccoli. And I just seasoned them with salt, garlic, uh, Lowry seasoned salt, and some granulated onion. And I'm going to pop them in the oven at 400 degrees for about 20 minutes. Then I'll stir them, and then it's usually about 10 more minutes from there. All right, here it is all cooked up. Got an extra tray of potatoes right here for another time, another dinner or breakfast. Or I might package some up and throw them in the freezer so I can grab them out quickly for a quick side dish and just reheat them in the air fryer. Here's the broccoli, radish, and turnips, and dinner for tonight potatoes. And there's all those greens. Look how small they got. I seasoned them with some salt and Lowry seasoned salt. 
uh, garlic powder and onion powder. All right, my husband's bringing in the hamburger, so we're gonna have some dinner. Thanks for hanging out with me, guys.